Introducing three new heat-friendly synthetic styles in the push line by Week Studio One. We're gonna do an unboxing and check them out. Andrea Carlson, the CEO and founder of Wig Studio One, has created three new stunning heat-friendly synthetic styles for her new push line. You can find more detail on these on the Wig Studio One website. All you have to do is go below the video and expand the description box. I'll attach a direct product link to each one of the featured styles today. If you click on the link, it'll take you right out to the site where you can explore all of the colors and pricing. This line is exclusive to Wig Studio One. You will not find it anywhere else. She used bell tress to create the styles. You'll see all of the familiar bell tress colors on these styles. It's always nice when you have some infrastructure built into this process. It's not easy to select a factory and go about this from scratch. And so we welcomed bell tress as the maker of this new heat friendly push line. So today we're going to start with Vivienne in the color brown sugar sweet cream, one of my favorite bronze of all time. Why do I love this one so much? You got it. It's this wave. It's just a soft whispering of wave. So it's a mid to long length, about 15 inches overall, and it features this delicate deconstructed wave pattern with this super light density that culminates in this amazing natural looking style that just moves and flutters on a breeze. It just whispers. This one has a lace front and left monofilament side part. And I'm gonna show you a look at the inside of the cap when we do our unboxing of another style with an identical cap. If you see it in the Beltrust Cafe collection, you're probably going to be offered that on this particular style. Don't we love it? Because there's some familiar notes to this. You can get your favorite Beltrus colors on a beautiful new style because you're not gonna find this style on any other style by Beltrus. I think it closely resembles the Dalgona 16. Of course, this one's gonna be a little bit shorter, that sweet spot of 15 inches, plus the layering is just more delicate. It's a little bit longer, so there's a little less choppy layering, which gives it that elegant French-inspired look. Got more of a smooth crown going here. And this fiber is just so beautiful. Look at the way it just bounces and flutters. I, it's that buttery soft fiber that we're used to with Beltrass. It's super delicate and such a light density. I just can't get over how natural this looks. Um, it also reminds me of something like Wavy Day by Raquel Welch. Um, that is a very popular style. This one's an even lighter density, an even more natural density compared to that wavy day. And these side pieces at 13 to 14 inches, they just coil back and away from the face. So there was a little bit of natural contour right at the front, but I coaxed that out just a little bit with the heat of my hand. And it's separated beautifully. Don't you just love how it softly frames the face while staying out of the face? So let's do an unboxing. Let's take a look at Colette. Colette, another French inspired style in that push line. Look at this packaging, isn't it gorgeous? It's an understated elegance, some nice neutral colors, a shiny embossed logo, pushed hair by Wig Studio One. Let's take a look. You'll find that it's packaged extremely well, everything that you would be used to with a high quality brand. And there's a picture here from the photo shoot for this new line and the back of it. A little note from Andrea, I'll read it to you. Push Hair by Wig Studio One. Thank you for putting your trust in me. I am so excited to bring these beautiful crafted, uh, amazing styles to you. I hope you love the Push brand as much as I have loved creating it. Wishing you the absolute best, XOXO, Andrea. Isn't that gorgeous? So a little welcome to the line there. You're gonna see a hang tag. And then the packaging is gonna be something uh, familiar and well packaged, actually, all right. A little straw that dropped there, that straw that kind of holds the tissue paper in place on the inside of the cap. Beautiful. bouncy that is. Isn't that fun? It's smooth and then it comes up into this whimsical 
soft round curl. Oh my gosh, is that gorgeous. This is in the color Root Beer Float Blonde. So let's go ahead and look at the cap because Colette's cap is going to be identical to Vivian. So there's an extended lace front. Look at that lace front moving all the way back through that ear tab. Beautifully contoured, left monofilament side part, a nice wide parting space, a velvet lined ear tab, an extended felted nape with the pull strap type adjusters, lots of stretch. What I can tell you is that this is your classic Bell Trust Cafe Collection fit. Um, it fits me very well if I cinch the adjusters in as far as it can go to accommodate my 21 and a quarter inch circumference. It can be let out and probably stretched to average large for sure. Beautiful features. Beautiful lace fronts. No seams, a nice fine knotting process. So I'm gonna remove the tag here and I'll be right back. Here is the gorgeous Colette. It's very different. You know, a lot of times you see a straight style like this that blankets the shoulder, uh, but you know, the layers are kind of point cut and very modern and textured, where this one seems to be more soft and buoyant at the bottom. I think that just gives it that really fun flair while being super elegant and decidedly feminine also. Look how soft and appealing this curl is. Colette is about 16 inches in its curl pattern. If you relax these waves, I think you're gonna get something more like 17 to 18 inches. So it just all depends on that curl. You're really going to love this eight inch fringe. They, uh, that eight inch fringe just frames the face. It kind of stays out of the face. Again, this is right out of the box, guys. Colette is going to feature a medium density. It's beautiful and lush looking without having a really heavy density. I really love that. So you're getting this buoyancy and this fabulous movement. See that there's a little bit of baked in contour on those front pieces that keeps it out of the face and it's just ready for you to get your fingers in there and make it your own. I can really see this being an amazing little updo wig, a little French bun or bouncy pony. And it looks beautiful just sort of cascading around the shoulders and down the back. Just so super sweet and feminine. So let's unbox our third and final French inspired synthetic piece by the push line. This one's called Amelie in Butter Beer Blonde. Talked about the packaging, the welcome note. Now this one is going to be a smooth polish, Bob. Very sophisticated and sleek looking. And it's an inverted bob as well, giving it that really modern French look. This one here is completely straight, really salon fresh. Oh my goodness. And this one has a full monofilament top. So an extended lace front and full monofilament top. Butter Beer Blonde, guys. That's the color on this one. Uh, now let's take a look real quick at the cap. We've got an extended lace front, beautifully contoured, <clears throat> a single monofilament top, beautiful natural looking features there, a velvet covered ear tab, and an extended velvet nape with the pull strap type adjusters again. So I'm gonna make an adjustment and get this on. Now this one doesn't have the layering and so sometimes that throws me a little bit around the face because I have to find a parting space that works to keep it out of the eyes but also to show off all of the features. Okay, now it has a full monofilament top, so you can align your parting space anywhere along the top, get the natural illusion of scalp. Look at the elegance of this. It's just perfectly polished. 
inverted angled bob. It has a little bit of an asymmetrical look depending on how you want to part it in the front. This one absolutely reminds me of the Alpha Blend by Beltress, but with the Alpha Blend, I felt like that was too long and cumbersome. This one is about 13 inches. So we're talking about 11 inches here off of the crown. And then that graduates into a 13 inch side piece there. So that is going to come to the shoulder or maybe even above the shoulder on some of you. With me, because I'm short, it does graze my shoulder here, but how gorgeous. It doesn't get lost in my shoulder. It just kind of hugs the collar. Look at the buoyancy beauty there. Oh, it perfectly frames the face too. Sometimes I worry with bobs like this, you know, how's it going to look around the face? So you can find a parting space and then just start training it away from the face. Gorgeous lace front again. Just love how that layer breaks just at the collar. So expertly designed. So again, a nice light to medium density. You can definitely get an ear tuck. I don't know why. I always love testing a bob for an ear tuck. There's very limited permatease, low permatease, so you're not getting that big hump of permatease above the temple there or around the ear. So you can definitely wear it behind the ear, which is also a nice elegant look. I would say you can tuck it. So just for a different way to wear it, if you like to tuck the front around the ear and have that under tuck look, that kind of keeps it out of the face. Perfect for that corporate meeting and also evening. Just gorgeous. It looks fabulous, doesn't it? Again, Amelie, a beautiful French inspired full bob, inverted angular bob just the right length. So that's a beautiful preview of these three new French inspired heat friendly synthetics by Andrea at Wig Studio One in the push line. Be sure to check them out. Again, all of the links are below the video and watch for future content on these beautiful styles. We'll see you soon right here at Taz's Wig Closet.